The educational qualification of African leaders in juxtaposition to their performances is an irony. Africa has the most educated leaders in the world, and the continent continues to experience plodding progress. Many critics and social commentators have attributed this to the high level of corruption evident within African governments. Interestingly, former Zimbabwe President Robert Gabriel Mugabe was considered the most educated president in the world while he was alive. On paper, he was the most qualified man on earth to assume the position of president. Sadly, history does not speak too well of his achievements in Zimbabwe after his 37-year rule. One thing that the situation has proven is that educational credentials alone do not make a good leader. While we may agree that education is a fundamental ingredient in governance, the evidence or lack of it has made very little difference in African countries. And on that note, highly esteemed viewers, I would like to welcome you to Obito Info Hub. And if you are passing by, please do subscribe and click on that notification bell so that you'll be notified when we post more of these videos. Back to the core cool business. Here is the list of the top 10 most educated presidents from Africa in the year 2020. And on number 10, we've got President Paul Bia of Cameroon. President Paul Bia is the second president of the state of Cameroon. He assumed office on 6 November 1982, following the resignation of President Ahmadou Ahijo. His academic qualifications include a BA in Law and Political Science from University of Paris in Paris, France in 1960 a diploma from Institut de Deus Politics Paris in 1961, another diploma from Institut des Autes et Tudes Poetry May in 1962, and another diploma from Etudes Supernoreanus et Droid Public in 1963. On number 9, we've got President George Carlos de Ameuda Fonseca. President George Fonseca is a Cape Verdean politician, lawyer, and university professor who has been president of Cape Verde since 2011. He served as Minister of Foreign Affairs from 1991 to 1993. His academic qualifications include graduate in law from University of Lisbon in Portugal, master's in legal sciences Faculty of Law, University of Lisbon, in Portugal again. And on number 8, we have got Namibian President H. Kane Gob. H. Kane Gob is the president of Namibia. He took power in 2015 after serving in different leadership positions. His academic qualifications include a Bachelor of Arts from Fordham University in New York, a Master's of Arts in International Relations from Graduate Faculty of the New School in New York again. And on number 7, we've got a former footballer, George Way of Liberia. Before venturing into politics, George Way was a football player famously known as one of Africa's best players of all time. He had played in the UEFA Champions League as well as the English Premier League. He also became the first and only African player to win FIFA's World Best Player and other Noteworthy Awards. His academic qualifications include an honorary degree in BA in Sports Management from Parkwood, a degree in Business Administration from Devry University in Miami, a master's degree in Management from Keller's Graduate School of Management. And on number six, we've got President Faure Esozima Nasibe of Togo. Faure Esozima Nasibe became the president of Togo on 24 April 2005 and he has remained so ever since then. He grabbed the power following his father's Nasibe Eadami's death, who had already ruled the country for about 38 years. His academic qualifications include a bachelor's degree in financial management from Sorbonne in Paris a master's degree in business administration from George Washington University in the United States. And on number five, we've got President 
Ibrahim Bubakar Keita from Mali. Ibrahim Keita has ruled Mali since 2013 and according to reports, his administration focuses on one key goal, that is to eliminate corruption from the country. For this reason, he swears not to tolerate even the slightest dishonesty. And his academic qualifications are as follows. He studied at the Lycée Janson de Sahil in Paris and Lycée Askia Mohamed in Bomako. He said that at the University of Dakar, the University of Paris, and the Institute de Histoire des Relations Internationale Contemporaines, commonly known as Institute of Modern History of International Relations. Ibrahim Keita has three degrees in political relations, history, political sciences, including graduate degrees in international relations. He also has a master's degree in history. And on number four, we have got President Alassane Kouattara of Ivory Coast. President Alassane has been at Ivory Coast, a home of leadership, since 2010. He is a seasoned economist and financial expert. Critics argue that his understanding of economics has significantly impacted and sustained the economy of Ivory Coast, making it one of the best in terms of economic growth in Africa. That's commendable. And his academic qualifications include a Bachelor of Science degree from Drexel University in Philadelphia from Pennsylvania, Master's degree in Economics from the University of Pennsylvania, a PhD in Economics from the University of Pennsylvania. And on number three, you've got President Peter Motariga of Malawi. President Motariga is a renowned international economic law expert. His remarkable academic qualifications were a big reason behind his success at the presidential polls in 2014. He served as an advisor to his elder brother, ex-president Bingo Omtarika, who died in the year 2012. And his academic qualifications include Law degree from the University of London Master of Laws degree from Yale University Doctor of Science of Law degree from Yale University again and on number two, we have got King Mohammed VI of Morocco. King Mohammed VI took over the throne of Morocco in 1999 after the death of his father, King Hassan. As king, he is the superpower of Morocco and is responsible for appointing a prime minister in the country. And his academic qualifications include a bachelor's degree in law from Mohammed V University in Agdao a PhD in law from the French University of Nice, Sophia Antipolis. And the big one goes to President John Pombe Magofuli of Tanzania. Yes, you heard me well. Our number one is President John Pombe Magofuli of Tanzania. President Magofuli is a seasoned educationist and chemist nicknamed the Tanzanian bulldozer. Dr. John Magufuli became the president of Tanzania in 2015. He was a former school teacher. He has a PhD in chemistry. And his academic qualifications include a BSc in chemistry from University of Dar es Salaam, a master's degree in chemistry from University of Dar es Salaam, a doctorate in chemistry from the same university. 